Yes. Bipartisan Campaign Reform Act of 2002. Yes. <laughs> I couldn't find it. I looked under campaign. It's bipartisan. Yes. Now, would that be tripartisan if there's uh, three uh, political parties? Yes. Bipartisan. B I P A T P P A R. You know, I'm going to continue to just stomp the shit out of out of every oath, badge, attorney, mandatory reporter, civil rights coordinator, all the employees of the schools that are legally liable, until you dumb fuckers remove your fraud. Bipartisan. Bipartisan. Now, it's against the law to issue court orders where you know there's forgery and fraud. Mm -hmm. It's against the law to take a citizen's uh, sons without any due process of law, <laughs> without the authority of law. <laughs> and it is against the law to make up crimes where you arrest individuals <laughs> just because you don't like them. <laughs> it removes the availability of the plea bargaining. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Bipartisan, yeah. Mm -hmm. B I P O oh, Bishop's Court bit bipartisan. Yeah. Mm. Now let's say that um, bipartisan campaign reform act. Yes. Uh it's a statute amending the Federal Election Campaign Act. Yeah. Closing the FECA loophole. Mm. That allowed corporation union private citizens to make unlimited contributions to national political parties. Oh. Prohibiting national parties from raising or spending uh, non-federal funds. Yes. Mm -hmm. In Citizens United versus the Federal Election Commission. Yeah. Supreme Court struck down portions of the BCRA banning the broadcast or transmission of electioneering communications paid for by a corporation or union within 30 days before presidential primary and 60 days before the general election. Yeah. Holding that those provisions violated the First Amendment. Oh, McCain Feingold. There it is, Federal Election Campaign Act. <laughs> now, let's say I decided, right, that I'm going to contribute, right, a billion dollars, maybe two billion on my own, because <laughs> I'm going to sue every police department in the United States. And as I see it, I could start a super PAC, right, without violating the actual laws. Yes. And I could sue you, the uh, oaths, yes, state legislatures, poop. city councils, uh -oh. county commissioners, yes, for knowingly obstructing my right to run for office because of your refusal to enforce your oath of office. <laughs> and then knowingly obstructing my right to start a third party, yeah known as tripartisan campaign, <laughs> and then you <laughs> have decided, well, it's a big lawsuit. It's one of those big ones. Yeah, mm -hmm. it really is. <laughs> now, did you want to give me my sons today? Well, there's what's known as a birth certificate. Mm -hmm. Formal document that records a person's birth, play, birth date, birthplace, and parentage. Yes. Why don't you get me the birth certificates of every individual that's in office right now? Mm -hmm. uh, 50 states adopt a child receives a second birth certificate reflecting his or her adoptive parents. Yes. That would mean Legina has a second birth certificate that was issued from the state of Washington. Yes. And within the confines of issuing that, uh, Mike decided to abuse and um, exploit his adopted daughter from Haiti. Yes. Now, the birth certificate gives you certain rights as a citizen of the United States of America. <laughs> I'm going to sue the state of Washington. Yes, for refusing right now. Pooch. I'm telling you. Give me the birth certificate of Legina. And then give me what the law says about a parent. Yes, exploiting the adoption of their daughter. Pooch. After a second birth. <laughs> Now, state of Washington, for every individual in the state legislature, for the executive branch of this state, for every individual in law enforcement, I want to know. I'm going to sue you, yes, for refusing 
to enforce child abuse and child neglect laws. <laughs> and then I'm going to sue you for the abuse of an adopted daughter. Yes, where it wasn't her mother in a picture in a Rotary newsletter. No, it wasn't. <sighs> and then I'm going to sue you for not enforcing the birthright of the birth certificate. Some of my five sons, I'm going to talk to you for right now. <laughs>